Welcome back. This is HappyAndBetter.tv. We're so excited you decided to join us. And we have a great guest with us today, the great Bo Henderson, Bo, Barrington Bo Henderson. We know him as Bo, and he resides here in Las Vegas, so you know we just love him. He's a part of our family. Bo, thank you so much for joining us today. Well, thanks for having me again. Uh, I'm black. I, I mean, I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> You're all of the above. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. And you, you've been with uh, groups that won platinum uh, recognition, platinum albums. You've won Grammys. You've been on the Soul Train Award. Yeah. For all, what I, is your I, most memorable? I, I, well, of course... Uh, you know, doing Motown Live, doing the the Motown Live show with uh, Stevie Wonder, and uh, you know what we did. It was like a Christmas celebration, and uh, of course, going to the Grammys twice. We went we went to the Grammys twice. We uh, first went on Phoenix, was one, was on Phoenix Rising. We lost that endeavor to um, Patti LaBelle that year. Mm. Back, came back the year 2000, that was 98, came back 2000 with Irresistible and got the nod and uh, won the Grammy. That was like uh, the epitome. And I owe all of that to Otis Williams and The Temptations. The Temptations. You know? What are some of the songs you guys recorded together? Oh, uh, you know, Stay, How Can He Hurt You, um, then the Irresistible album, um, It's All Right to Be Wrong. It's, it, you know, just. The hits, uh, and, a classic. and also on that Irresistible album, also, I'd like to make note that there were two songs that were produced by um, Gerald Levert, the late, ah. great Gerald Levert. He produced two songs, and it was a pleasure working with him. And then Joe also produced a song on that album. So um, it's been a whirlwind, but it's been, all, it's been all good, a lot of memories. I bet. You've been so <laughs> blessed to be in the right environment. You yeah. mentioned Gerald Levert. He was such a great singer and writer. I happen to know that you're a great writer. Yeah, so. I, I do write. Uh, I haven't, you know, I haven't really gotten my recognition in that particular uh, category, but uh, hopefully it's forthcoming. I think this, that's going to be the primary part of this next chapter of my life and my music. Absolutely. I, I have to tell a story about him. Uh, I was in a home, and Bo came in, and Bo had this big notebook, and it was filled with these songs he had written. So he would sing a little of each song, and one in particular, I wish I knew the name of it. I'm like, yes. He says, oh, I'm keeping this one. It's mine. It's mine. <laughs> you need to pull those songs out and record them most famous. Yeah. Uh, that's my plan, and I've been stockpiling uh, a pretty sizable um, you know, songbook, and um, I'm I'm working some you know some very strategic angles right now, and I will be releasing uh, some material very soon. That so is great. Is there anything you could hum for us and give the people a little tease of what's going to come of some something you've written? Wow! Uh, I'm putting so, him on the spot, on the ladies spot. and gentlemen. He uh, had so, no idea I was going to ask so this question. It's so many songs. I'm trying to. Uh, wow! I'm trying to think of one. I, I got. We don't have any tracks got, in the studio either. This is all improv now. to live. Uh, let me see. What? What's one? What, nothing really comes to what's mind. What's the latest right? uh, one you've written? Well, you know, I've I've really been I've been working on some songs, and I'm getting ready to uh, uh, pitch uh, to Floyd Mayweather. I've been working on some some fight theme songs. Good. I've kind of flipped the script, and I've been working. I brought in a, a rapper, a brother by the name of Diesel, who's dynamic. Diesel, you guys, all the, the other people out there, and uh, I've been working on some fight theme songs. At TMT, the Money Team. Uh, um, you know, stamina for sale. I, I, I've been working on some themes on why you run your mouth. I've been just working on. Mm. Th that's been my main focus because I just decided to just kind of stretch the envelope and do some other stuff. So this other stuff has been more kind of R&B, hip hop, rap, related. which is so popular now, Bo. I I go down to um, the weigh-ins. Yeah. I mean, and everybody should go. They're free. They're at the MGM, and it's something to see. Yeah. And that, uh, what is it, UFC is huge. Yeah. They have like 18,000 people that will come out for a weigh-in. And to me, it's a fashion show because the girls look absolutely stunning. They wear <laughs> all kind of yes, outfits. Yes, all the indeed. way from the strip 
to the conservatives. <laughs> it's a show. It's a show. And those of us who live here, definitely you need to go. But the music they play during the way in and before and in between, it is awesome. And I find myself jumping around and enjoying it. So that's very uh, appropriate yeah, I, that you yeah. would switch over to that genre. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, it, 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 it uh, the whole conceptualization came, me being here in Vegas, I'm a big fan of Floyd Mayweather, I've followed his whole career, and here lately I've, um, I've had a pr pleasure of meeting him, and I, I went to uh, uh, his girlfriend's uh, grand opening at her boutique, uh, yeah. a store that he bought. And, and it's beautiful. Uh, and I've met, uh, met his dad, I want to say hi to Floyd Sr., send shout outs, I've met his mom, I want to say shout outs to Jeannie, and yeah. I've met a lot of his, uh, you know, people that are close to him, family and uh, business related and uh, you know Mr. Leonard Ellaby I've met so being here being a fan of his it it was an idea that I had just got and it turned into a labor of love and I've put together a compilation of tracks inside of this world and I'm getting ready to you know I just had a, a vision I just had a vision the Floyd Mayweather in the September fight coming up September 12, is yeah. going to have your music on as he drives his SUV into the you arena. You know what? I, in the name of Jesus, <laughs> I, I receive it. You know? <laughs> they say with two or more agrees, and so it is. So it is. All right is. now. All right I, now. I just said that. All right, Floyd, you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. And he knows how. When he came in with that SUV before the last fight with Pacquiao, yeah. it was hilarious because people were like, you can't do that. <laughs> oh. Mr. Mayweather, he's doing that. Yeah. It was done. So yeah, that's great. And you're also, <coughs> um, with your writing, you're still performing. And yeah. in fact, don't you have a show coming up soon? Yeah, actually, I'm, I'm doing the show uh, down at Ron DeCar's Event Center. Uh, a beautiful uh, Yeah, which is venue. 1201 uh, Las Vegas Boulevard. And uh, beautiful room, beautiful ambiance, nice sound system. And I'm doing it with uh, one of the local popular and very talented singers, uh, Miss Queen Aries. And uh, we put together a band, and uh, we're going to do uh, an extravaganza show with a taste of Motown, of course. Can't leave, out, leave that out. Yes. And I'll be doing some Temptation songs that I recorded and had the pleasure of uh, performing with the fellas. And uh, Queen Aries will be doing her thing. She'll be accompanying me. And it's going to be a, a nice night of entertainment. It'll be uh, August 29th. And also, by the way, which is Michael Jackson's birthday. So it has a lot of a uh, lot of significance. Yes. You know, and uh, and it's also my girl Shari, her birthday. Oh, beautiful. So 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 it has this. It has like uh, a lot to be. of yeah. It has a lot of significance, and yes. uh, it's going to be a special night. Yes, it is. That is beautiful. And my mama's probably she'll probably be there and sing also. Well, we're joining you, the Happy and Better <laughs> TV team. Right we're, on. We plan to be there at uh, well before seven. The, the door is open, I think, about five o'clock. Yes. And they have a buffet. It's buffet. really wonderful. So yeah. you can come eat, socialize with your friends that are there, and then the show starts around seven. Show starts around seven. Yes. Yeah, Saturday, that's August be 29th. Nice. Oh, that's going to be wonderful. We'll be there with our bells on. Um, and with that, um, I, I wanted to ask you, you know I had a senior moment right there. But <laughs> you have senior, I have senior, I, I don't, 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 I mean, don't even worry about that. I have some you senior moments I, too. I'm, I, I I'm, say I'm, just, right now I'm sweating. Just breathe in. <laughs> I'm sweating like a man on his way to the electric chair. I don't know if it's, uh, I don't know if, if, if it's the Las Vegas heat or if it's just me being in the presence of a judge. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but I, I am so thankful to you. <laughs> you are so kind, and we look forward to the many things you're going to do in the future. Thank you. I appreciate uh, it. So are you basically going to sing with uh, the Queen, just like you and your band, sort of a Yeah, I'm, I'm going to open the show uh, and do some selections, and then I'm going to uh, invite Queen and to join me, and we're going to do some nice selections and let her do her thing, and then I'll come out, come back out and and close it, you know, close the show. That is so wonderful. Now, I have to ask your permission, is it okay if we run like a calendar of what you're doing around town and you need to know a Bo Henderson is coming out with a new CD? Can we put all those things on our website? Most definitely. And just keep people current it. to what you're doing? Yeah. And it's like, it'll be your second home 
for your information about you, they can go to our website Most definitely. and get information about what you're doing. That. Yes, oh, we, yes, indeed. Because we've adopted you. You're part of the family, and we're All not right, going to well, let I'm you go. I'm happy to be adopted. Oh, you know, yeah. Because I'm an I'm only child, so okay. I'm, 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 I'm happy to be adopted. <laughs> that is so great, so great. And you do live here in Vegas. Yeah. Good. Don't leave us. No, I'm not I, leaving. Yeah. I love it. Yeah, I love it here, too. Yeah. I, I commute back and forth to Los Angeles, which is my original home, but uh, I love it here in Vegas. Yeah. And amazing. I feel like I have work to do here. Well, thank you so much for joining us again. We're very grateful to you. Thank and you. And I just want to invite everybody that when you come to Vegas, check us out and you can find out where Bo is performing and see him in person. He's so wonderful. He's just a big teddy bear. He will sign autographs, give you a hug. Most so uh, you will enjoy seeing him. And Remember, God loves to get knee mail. See you next time on happyandbetter.tv. All right.